ready. We. Hey, Autumn, you haven't really talked to me in a while. That doesn't look like the black quill. Oh my gosh, this looks like children's drawings. Oh, look at the little, little chompy wolf and a wand in Hogwarts Castle. Oh, that's so cute. I have my theories. <laughs> Missing what? Why aren't you agreeing with me, Tulip? Oh, whoops. Yeah, I don't know what that drawing means. There's an anchor person. Oh, so I have to leave Hogwarts? Darn! Yeah, so I'm just gonna drop out. Oh. So either she's riding them to herself to try and throw us off the trail, or, you know, the Hogwarts um, theme has continued, where the person who seems to be evil turns out not to be. This is too hilarious. Ah! <laughs> no, I was joking, guys. What if I didn't? Oh, well, then. We really should get some ghosts on our side, because, you know, they can go through walls. Portraits, too. I mean, you can, like, they know a bunch of stuff, and they can go all over the place. Oh, yeah, that's still a thing. Eating a bunch of Hogwarts children, duh. Reparo. Just take skies. What? Why did I think of that before? Glare. I don't know, I just decided to glare at you, I suppose.
Can someone get these darn balloons out of my way? So you mean before jumping right to stealing, we maybe should have asked a friend for help? I don't know, wait. We're gonna try and make one or steal one from Hogsmeade. Always go for stealing first and then consider if someone can help you out. Really, they should ask a teacher. Like seriously, why didn't Madame Hooch like ask them for more information and then like try investigating the the forest herself or with other teachers? Um I don't wanna ruin that guy's broom. He's too nice. So if I ruin her broom <laughs> Oh, she wouldn't. I just wanted the courage points. Ugh. Ugh. But you prefer the hog's head in. You're so nice. <gasps> oh no! Oh, dang! I hope he's okay. Yeah, she's got a point there. Because <laughs> I said so. Friendship, no! Why do you look sad? You're a good friend! That's the spirit. I mean, yeah, the only people who ever got expelled, actually the only person who ever got expelled was Hagrid. Not even Voldemort got expelled. Maybe he'd actually listen to me, unlike Madame Hooch. <coughs> Look at us sharing butterbeers like a pair of friends. We're not. Friends, I'm out of here. No way, come back. <laughs> Wait a second, why did I agree to this? Oh, really? <laughs> she went from drinking to what? Spilled her butterbeer all over her lap. Okay then. Wait a sec, we're taking friends in? 
Do each of them have to borrow or steal a broom? Uh-oh. Whee. Wait a second. What? Ah, a new uh, creature set quest. Okay, Charlie. So we, we doing this for real now? We, whoops. Oh well, she just walked up. Not yet, we need a personal, uh, pointless energy game first. I haven't let Ro Rowan do anything in a while. That was it. That was it. <laughs> Seriously? So is it an irreversible decision? Oh, is he coming after me? I'm gonna kill her. How dare she say that to you? Yeah, you've been, like, not around. Charlie and me! That's not bad. It'll be the first time Autumn has ever gotten detention. Are you, like, considering something? No? No, I guess, I guess you're not. Okay. I mean, I don't like Tonks and Tulip get it all the time. But there's no T in your name, Rowan, so you're not gonna get it. <laughs> there would be another way if Madam Hooch would help us. Thanks, Rowan. Also, I don't have a broom. Considering how much story we have left, I get the feeling we're not going to the forest just yet.
I'm not holding your broom. Thank you. Don't split the party. Oh, we're gone. Okay. Whee! Well, we already lost our guide. But a terrible guide. You're supposed to wait up for your slowest members. You should probably have your wands out just to be safe. <laughs> Maybe we should stand back to back and keep our eyes open. Is it supposed to be in this open grove? It's in that tree. It's in that tree right there. Underneath the tree, probably. Climb into the trunk. Or under the roots. You can do that too. Take heed. Thanks, Rowan. You're making me feel so much better. Unicorn! Yay! Huh? Let's see, is there a spell to find people? Depending on the spell you use, it could be just as bad an idea as yelling out his name. So let's be, like, quiet, <laughs> I guess. No! It's a terrible idea. You're gonna draw every creature in the Forbidden Forest to you. I went considerably higher than in. Oh! Hmm. You son of a. You idiot. Get out. You're not allowed to be on our team. That's it? That's it? Well, that was an adventure? Whee. Oh, hey, Marilla. Dun dun! Dramatic zoom in. Hello, Bennett. <gasps> you! <laughs> this is just like the like the the big showdown with the villain. Didn't Autumn have a vision about a door lined in chalk? It's funny that Tulip didn't mention this beforehand. Then again, if they had cell phones like lowly muggles do, then she could have just 
shot a quick text to Autumn. Because, well, actually, no, it's the 80s. Never mind. They don't have... I guess friendship? <gasps> it's floating! <laughs> Plus, she let me borrow her broom. Which you haven't given back yet. Oh, yeah, I, I guess uh, I'll do that. You didn't break it, did you? No, 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 I, I did no. Yes, because we're friends. We're not friends. What drawing were we looking for and why? I already flew in there! And we explored the grove. I hope not, as it's sitting right on the wall. Okay. Go for it, Marula. Hey, don't sit there while I'm looking. I lament. Oh, yeah, that. Mm. Yeah. There's a lot of somethings under there, it looks like. <laughs> Honestly, she is very lucky considering she hasn't died yet, which is absolutely amazing. Oh, we had to go beyond the grove. Huh. That's unsafe. Hmm. That would be like, who, like, what other opportunity would we have to do something so stupid? <laughs> Let's see. Tulip got to go last year, so Penny probably, unless I really want to try that. Who am I kidding? She can make healing potions and poison potions will be fine. <laughs> I mean, if you want to tag along, sure. Well, you think they've been holding him hostage all these years? How long has it been? Four years? Since he disappeared? Oh, we're already here. Nice. Oh, duel. Oh, psh, just me and Penny. That sounds smart. But we can walk into a centaur camp uninvited? Oh, hey! Nice to meet you. We weren't gonna invade or anything. You're shirtless!
Uh. Yes. Uh, no, I don't have a brother. <laughs> He's got a point there. All right, let's do this. We can do this. We got this. Okay, but don't kill me, please. Let's see here. Let's be aggressive. Hehe, <laughs> it was the right choice. Oh, okay. But now I finally have something that can stun him. When I don't have, you know, all the extra stuff that I normally have. Oh, nice. That's awesome. Okay, now I'll just set you on fire. Oh no! <gasps> wow, that's a really good healing spell. Can I have that, please? Okay, maybe I'll just... And where was he carrying that? He has no belt or shirt. But I'm really, really good at it. I mean, tell me what it is, and if I find it, I'll give it back. This looks like an arrow. No, I don't know. Isn't it attached already? Her brother probably put it there. Sorry. Sounds like him leaving problems for Autumn to clean up. Oh, man, that sucks. I'm so sorry, buddy. Hmm. 
Eh, makes it feel any better, he might be dead. He's not the one from the book, is he? Is he the one from the book? I don't remember. Congratulations, Penny, you did nothing. If I had brought Marula, she would have been like, yeah, I already knew that. <laughs>